and we are now going to start playing again. So let's um, begin our adventure. I think we left off. We had just fought some, I think, black mages, and we were in this little alcove that I wanted to explore. So that's what we're going to do now, and uh, we'll see about getting that done. So we already been up in that little cross up there, but there's two little L-shaped areas here I have not been. So that's where we're targeting right now. We're looking for treasure. We'll go up to the top one first, which is this one. Okay, I think we are in there. So the bottom one had some doors, so that's what we'll do over there door boom okay there's nothing in here okay so This room is filled with old scrolls and cracked and crumble in your hand. Most of them are evil. Interesting. All right, so we're in a hallway with... Ooh. We have found treasure. We found the treasure pile. We found a white scroll. All right. This is cool. We found the treasure pit. Nice. Is there more treasure over there? You found a scroll. I bet you it's a red scroll. I'm pretty... Alright, looks like we found the treasure pit that that guy was talking about. North and to the west, right? I guess it's... Not bad. Okay. So let's just real quickly look. There's this little area right there. We have to search... I think, like, this area here. Well, no, this was where the scroll was. So just this area and this area. And we should be good. Okay. Let's do that. Let's go down in here. <gasps> Got some hobgoblins. Hobgoblins approach, grinning. The soldier steps up to them and says, See, I told you I could bring them in. So, I could bring in some entertainment. The soldier joins your foes and attack. Oh, he was a bad guy. Man, I thought maybe he wasn't, because, like, he'd fought a lot of people. Well, that sucked. So, there are a lot of hobgoblins. There's a couple of goblin leaders. Let's kill the goblin leader right there. Nope. And that, we're going to sleep everybody. Sleep. Manual. I think we're going to sleep these guys right here. Sleep, 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 sleep. Oh, yeah, that was a good one. Um, we're going to have this guy move down and kill that guy. Oh, jeez. And then we're going to have this guy kill that guy. Then we're going to go cast more sleep on our soldier friend. can't target that guy. How about... Fine. Sleep, sleep, sleep. Those four. All right. Let's risk it. Dang it. Yusuf. No. Wait. Why do we have control of that guy? Weird. Well, I'm going to have him kill his... You know what? I'm not going to do anything with this guy. I read somewhere that they could, this could be meffed up. So I'm just going to ignore it. All right, let's kill the helpless ones.
guy has a lot of health. And he's impossible to hit. How about this? We remove his armor. Ready, ready, ready. Now he has crappy armor, which means hitting should be easier. Because to hit armor class 0, so 18 plus 9, so uh, 9 or better to hit this guy now. Right? This guy has a Thaco of 18, so yeah, 9 or better. So better than half the time we'll hit this guy. Yep. All right, 172 experience. So that's a little weird that it, the the way I somebody told me about that bug that sometimes these NPCs can get a little messy. You got to be careful. I think the plate mail is worth taking because it's expensive. I'll take a shield too. And it's long sword, because that's the only thing out of the ordinary. Alright. Do you want to take treasure? No. Wait. Yes. Is there anything else? No. There's no money. Okay. Do you want a treasure? No. We're good. A knight of Salami approaches. That was cool. A knight of Salami approaches. He introduces himself as Larson Strangleborn. Hey, this is the guy that Kender talked about. And says that he is looking for Karaman, his commander. And he recorded his journal entry... 67. Well, he could have come and help us fight. Um, let me pull up journal entry 67. I was with the patrol that followed Caraman in here. We ran into some trouble almost immediately. We were not really expecting much opposition, but we were ambushed by a large force of hobgoblins and draconians. I was knocked out by a blow to the head early in the battle. I woke in a dark corner alone. It took me a while to get my bearings, but I finally went out in search for my companions. I overheard from a passing patrol that everybody except Carmen was killed. You must help me find Carmen. He must not be allowed to fall into the hands of the leader of this band. Okay. Do you want to let him join? Yes. Strangleborn asks you about Sir Carl. After hearing your answer, he hesitates and tells you a story, and you record it as Journal Entry 7. Okay. Journal Entry 7. Let me, um, pull up Journal Entry 7. Journal 7. Listen, Sir Carl is the most honorable of men. I'd follow him anywhere, but there's something very dark and strange going on around him. He seems obsessed with a young girl named Maya. The fact that he's about 40 years older than she isn't really the problem. It's not. It's quite a bit younger. If they just settle down and declare themselves, all would be that all, all that would happen is a few gossip, gossips will snicker and that would be the end of it. But they won't do that. Maya is extremely valuable to us. She has a source of in, sources of information that are outstanding, especially one for one so young. But whenever the two of them are in the same room, the tension is so obvious that... Uh, well, never mind. You say that he seems to be all right. I'll go on that hope. And let trouble find me. And let troubles find me in their own good time. Let's go. Sorry, that was a... Get a little tongue twisted. All right. What was I doing? I'm going to encamp and fix my guys, because we took a couple of punches from that soldier guy. We did cast some magic. Let's. I'm gonna do my magic memorizations, just cause I don't want to be left without a sleep spell. Uh, cause they are important to surviving, I think. Um, doesn't have any. Doesn't have any. All right, rest. 
Hold a rest for four hours. Memorize some spells. Exit. We'll save. No. And exit. All right. Check out. Okay, so we're on the right path. We want to move down this little hallway. Stringleborn stops you. Wait, he cries. There is a trap here. He sets it out harmlessly. All right, let's go up. A cleric and draconians are rushing from the north. You hear, someone was at the trap. They spot you. What do you do? We attack them. Okay, we can't see them. Can I cast spells at them? Sleep. Oh, no. I can't target them. There's a cleric. Oh, it's out of my range. I'm going to lose a spell. All right, let's, let's go up. And we're going to guard, so if they come in next to us, we'll be ready for them. We'll move up, and we'll guard with them. No, we'll actually target the cleric. Missed. Yeah, <laughs> stupid how going. All right, that guy is trapped, so we're gonna do is delay this guy's action. We're gonna move this guy up. Gonna move this guy up one, two, and then we can cast sleep with this one. And then we'll be close enough to get these guys. Sleep. 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 That was a lot. So let's. Boom. Let's uh, cast another sleep spell on the last remaining guys. Target on that cleric. Yep. Oh, we didn't get him. But Strangleborn now can not do anything. Nice. Plate mail slows our guys down quite a bit. Delay our actions until these guys can move. Uh -oh. Done and guard. Done and guard. Move behind this guy. Move in from the top. I don't want to attack him. But we do want to open up space. There we go. So we won the battle. Two sleep spells. Continue battle. No. I think we're fine. I don't think we're going to bother with them. Um... We do need to sleep, though, because Kidroff looks to be pretty hurt. Oh, two gems and a ton of steel. How's it worth it? All right. Yes, yes, we do want to claim it. What else was there? There's a mace, some more chain mail, and a shield. I th we want the chain mail, and I want to give it to you. this Shorgoth. Yeah, Shorgoth doesn't have it yet. Let's detect, just in case. No, nothing's magic, so we'll just take the chain and call it good. And we'll view item. Ready this. 
We don't need it anymore. We'll just drop it. And we'll equip this. And let's join our darts with the other darts. Now we have a lot of darts. Better. More movement. Or maybe about the same amount of movement, but we have better armor. Indra needs armor, and so does Yusuf. Do you want to claim your treasure? No. So let's just real quickly go look. Okay. I think we have got all of this north area explored. I think we just have to go down into the southwest area. Um, there was a door leading into this hallway. So this, there wasn't a door here, so I don't, maybe we'll go down in there and just see what it is and then move on. But before that, we will fix our guys. Okay. I think, yeah, that's what we'll do. We'll just go down to this last door. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Oh, no. Bunch of things. A trap door opens. We're attacked. Okay, so. Sorry, taking a drink of water. Let's see what we have here. We have a cleric. A black robe mage. And a cleric. Okay, so we need to sleep some stuff. But this is... First, we're going to target the black robe mage. Because we don't want that guy casting sleep on us. So... We have to find the guy that's casting. No. No. There it is. Oh, we missed. Okay. We want to get to this Boz Draconian. Yeah. Okay, now we're going to cast some sleep. Boom. Boom. Sleep. Okay, we're going to cast Bless. Oh no, hold person. Dang. Dang. Okay, we gotta we gotta do the same thing. We gotta hold some people. We wanna hold this guy. And you can cast it to three people, so we'll target this guy. And we don't want our strangleborn to go down, so we're gonna target this Boz Draconian. Not affected. Held. Held. Okay. So what we want to do is kill this dress, this guy there. All right, we're gonna. Um, we're gonna aim. I just want to see like helpless, not helpless. Okay, I think I'm gonna kill this guy because killing guys is a good idea. Okay, we're gonna. Bless this guy. And that guy. Okay, we got some blessings. We're going to yell to try to get these people to not fight our health guys. Aim. Manual. Where's the help? Okay, boom. Cleric gone. Nope. Okay. Uh, do we have another sleep spell? No. <sighs> okay. We need to change our weapon from... Oh, man. We need to get this stuff identified. Okay. Let's ready the darts and kill more helpless people. This wizard. I oh, can't. Can't reach him. Okay, we'll target this guy. Oh, man. This guy's killing us. Alright. <sighs> Aim. Okay, that's good. Oh, this guy doesn't have a weapon. Let's cast magic missile on... 
Oh, that didn't put him. Oh, that was not useful. Okay, this is going badly for us. We lost our weapon, but... Okay. We need to equip a weapon. And then we need to start hitting. Okay, we can't use that weapon, so we'll switch off a dart back to the mace. And does it have a good spell? Let's double check to see if anybody is hurting. This person's hurting a lot. Okay, so we're going to just try to kill this Boz. Oh. oh man, we lost two people. Um, bandage. Okay. Bandage. Okay, we bandaged both those guys, so they're not going to die. Um, okay, I think we have burning hands, right? We'll hit this guy right here. Nope. Only affects one target. Okay, he doesn't have a weapon. We'll equip this one. Okay, cool. We have this guy back. Can we sleep? Yeah, let's sleep some more targets. Whew. This is going to help a lot. That was a crazy fight. We're going to need a rest. Continue battle, no. 250 or 266 experience, that's a lot. Money, probably a lot. Oh, not even that much money. Maybe some magic stuff. Got some more chainmail, a lot of it. Let's see, do I have anybody that's alive that can detect? Yeah, detect. Let's see. Nope. The shore girl uses darts. I think... I think we're going to have Yusuf take the chain mail. And maybe... He could probably use chain mail too. Yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to have him take the chain mail too. Um, they're both asleep, but we'll, uh, we'll equip them as soon as we're done sleeping. So, I think it's a good idea to rest here. Let's fix our guys. Alright, we're fixed. Let's, of course, do our memorization, because we are in trouble. Alright. Exit, yes. Memorize, no. Memorize. Two sleeps. Uh, memorize. We need burning hands for sure. That was cool. It's not. Oh, we should hit more guys. Um, 
we need detect magic, and then we need our hold person because that worked good. And then shore growth. We need um sleep sleep and a bonus spell. I think. I think we'll do read magic because we got a couple of scrolls. I'd like to look at those at some point. And then uh, we have two. Uh, we'll do this again. Oh, I can't do that. Oh, it's a wizard spell, so I guess magic missile. All right. Five hours, 15 minutes. All right. We survived. I will... Oh. Need to save. And let's go. Let's look where we are. I, oh, I can go down into that little room. We haven't gone in there yet. There's nothing here. Nope. We'll pick it. You see a chained figure to the south. But what's in here? Ah! Uh, what happened? We have to go back? Ah, uh, okay. Hi, I see. We gotta go north. We don't need search anymore, because we... I screwed up. Pick. Hope I don't get hit by traps again. Nope. Okay. And then, like... Yeah, okay. I, I'm actually pretty good at this. Then the hallway. End of the hallway. Oh, wait, nope. Not the end of the hallway. I remember now. See a chain figure to the south. Okay, what is that? Oh, we gained experience. You'll find Karaman in chains. As you free him, he tells you of his ordeals. And you record it as journal entry 73. So, journal entry 73. We have... After the battle, I was taken to see a powerful cleric. He laughed at my defeat. They led me to some doors that glowed in the darkness, opened them with a key that he pulled from his robes, and took me to, to the dark temple. I saw a bronze dragon egg on the altar. He told me that they were going to start the corruptions again. Then he had this minion beat me. I woke up here. If, I hadn't, if it hadn't been for the territory of the Dark Elf and a sneak attack from behind, they would never have captured me. He paused. I'm sorry for my men, he says. They had no idea what we were getting into. Crin's blood, I didn't know either. We were unprepared for the extents of the evil forces. The ambush was a complete surprise. All right. Suddenly you hear a great crashing from outside the room. A strange high-pitched tinkling sound is accompanied by a muffled scream. A female voice calls out for Carmen. He glances up, startled at the sound. Carmen yells, and in a moment, a figure appears in the doorway. Some type of ghost. A lovely elven woman strides in. Not a, a ghost. Just a f elven woman with no complexion. Uh, she embraces Carmen and explains her presence. And you record it as Journal Entry 9. Oh, wait. Let me, uh, I'll read Journal Entry 9 real quick. Went too fast, apparently. She explains to Kerman, I've been sent by Sir Carl to get you back to the outpost. There are rumors that large forces of draconian hobgoblins and minotaurs and others are gathering. We need you to direct scouting and raiding operations. I see now that things are worse than we thought. Thrattle was supposed to be have been abandoned, Kerman says. It's even worse than that. I see brass dragon eggs. She gasps. No, they must not do this again. Then paused. Wait, 
How can they do it? I thought the process was lost during the War of the Lance. Did you even see evidence that they were successful? No, says Caraman. I was knocked unconscious before I had a chance to look further. He turns to you. I need you to investigate this matter. Find the key and go to the old temple in the northwest or northeast part of the city. That's the only place we haven't gone, right? No, the part of the city. Find out what you can. Yeah, I think that's the only place we haven't gone. It's the northeast. Then Sir Carl says, "We must get back to we must get back to Sir Carl as well. Carmen will need our help. Please do as he asks." Wait, is that Strangleborn? Is he gonna leave me? Carmen says, "The cleric that took me has just left for his quarters in the southwest corner of Throttle." Wait, do we not go in the southwest? And you'll find the key. The key will make the door into the temple glow. The doors are located in the two corridors that border the northeast quadrant of the city. Carmen and Maya leave. You hear a great rush of air shortly after their departure. What, did they open a portal? Your companions leave. What, just left here? Now oh, I see how we act. Okay, this actually makes sense. This is the actual escape. The door closes behind you. Walls are thick with frozen bodies of cobgoblins and bars litter the floor. Huh. Frozen bodies. Okay, let me look at the map because I thought we had already gone everywhere. I wish you could move this map. We had been in this big room here. I guess we haven't gone in this area. And this must be the temple over here. So, like, this is the quadrants. I see this is a cross. This is the northwest, northeast, southeast, southwest. So we've done these two. We need to go in here to find a key to open up up here. Okay, that seems reasonable. I want to real quick look at our experience, though, because I think we're starting to get high in level. I think we should go back to Outpost, sell some gear, identify some stuff, and level. Because that would be cool. We need levels. Okay, you're near throttle. Do you want to enter? No. Oops. No. Do you want to enter? Yes. All right. Roland gives his tithe to the knighthood. All right, let's see. Um, first things first, let's go to the bar and grab a drink, because that was rough. Actually, we store money for... Your for you. We only accept monies in lots of 100 steel. And there's a processing fee of 20 steel pieces. Why would I do that? I don't know what a fault would be for then. Does steel weigh stuff? Ah, whatever. We'll have a drink. What do we have? Don't drink the beer because it's made with his feet. I think we'll just have regular ale this time. You hear Tavern Tale 19. Okay, we have to hear 19. So I'm going to... Tavern Tale 19 is... Draconians have been seen near Throttle. Things are heating up. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. We have seen some Draconians there. We'll have one more drink. I'll have... Uh, I can't... Oh. Renji will have a drink. And they will drink wine. And they will hear Tavern Tale 37, which is... The Traconians were led by an Urak. They are very deadly. Well, dang. I don't think we could take an Urak, can we? Let's just have our relaxation, and then we'll go to the armory. And that's when we hear Tavern Tale 2. So let me, uh, let me pull up Tavern Tale 2. And that is... Uh, even giants are being seen near the outpost... Glad we have some rangers and dwarves in the company. Rangers and dwarves are obviously good against giants. Alright, that was good. I think we'll do the armory and appraise stuff? No, we don't have anything to appraise. We do. We do have a gem. It is worth five. We will sell it. Does anybody else have a gem? Didn't we have two of them? 
I thought we found two gems. Huh. Okay, so... To sell stuff, you have to go into their inventory, right? Okay, we need to equip our longsword again. Our broadsword, that's right. He is... Was anything magic? I think just the scrolls he had were magic. Everything else was... We wanted to sell the plate for 50 gold, 50 steel. Yeah. And we already have a shield. Wait, was this... That's a lot. Um, let's trade everything to Madril. Trade to Madril. And then we'll have him do all the trading. Because I think Madril can cast the spell. No, we don't want to sell it. No. We want to trade it to Madril. Though I don't think we need to trade these. We just need re magic for those. Alright, let's see. And then. Does he have anything? He has chain. Oh, we wanted to equip chain, right? Ready. We want to ready this. No. We want to ready this chain. We'll trade the leather to Madril to sell. Train. Madril select. That's what I mean. Okay, and then exit. So he has nine movement and a, two armor classes. Much better. Indril, I think I... Um... Oh. I guess we can do it here. Um... He also had leather armor. Can thieves... Kenders? I guess he's a fighter thief, so... Do we get an extra set of... Okay, we're going to trade this to my... Actually, I'm going to, before I do this, I'm going to make sure Madril has that spell. Nope, he doesn't. So, we're going to trade all of this stuff to... He's using scale, so we're going to actually... Ready and do this, and then we're gonna trade this to Ren. Trade 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 to Ren. Oh, overloaded. I guess we'll just sell that to exit. All right. And then just show her off. Have anything? No, just the darts. And they are not magic darts. So, okay, let's give Ren the detect magic spell. Boom. And then, wait, did he not cast spell? Oh, you can't cast it here, so you have to exit. Magic cast detect magic. Okay, now we can go exit view items okay so it's these things here i think can we use this nope it says uh must be readied oh that's for using it all right in the white scroll so potion shield and the scroll so nothing else is magic that's fine magic i think we scribe these things right oh we don't have any scrolls to scribe Oh, do we have to read magic? Does anybody have that? Shorgoth has it. Shorgoth is... a red wizard. White wizard. Oh, Alright. Let's go. View item. Trade the white scroll to Shorgoth. Who's this guy? He's a red maid, so he needs to memorize read magic. And sleep. And exit. No, not exit yet. We wanna well no we do wanna. Wanna rest. This is silly. Rest, exit. Now we can cast read magic. Wait. Memorize. Select, select. 
exit. I think yes. Rest. Rest. Okay. Then we can cast read magic. And scribe. Oh, these are so. Can he scribe these? No. Nope. What about him? Oh, yes, cast read magic. And then scribe. Can he scribe? No. Nope. These are out of our league right now. I guess they're just spell scrolls. So we can't learn them. Alright, let's... I think... I think we gotta keep these things ourselves with a read magic, unfortunately. So, we're gonna do that for these two. I don't think there's any other way to do it, because we need to be able to do, read scrolls from... Now and then, all right, let's, now let's go identify that stuff. How much money do we have? We go to Armory. Now we're going to do this, and then I'm going to call it for this run. Let's ID the shield. It costs 100. Wait. Oh, I don't have enough money. Pool. Take. I should have enough money. All right, I take it all. Now. Okay, so we need to view, ran, we need to sell the stuff we're not going to use. We're not going to use this shield. So sell this shield for zero steel. And the scale mail. And this shield. And this long sword. This long sword. And this leather armor. Okay, so apparently it's not worth picking stuff up that's not magic. Unless it's a direct upgrade. Okay, now we should have some money. No, we don't. Not enough, so take it all. Okay. View items ID. Yes. Plus one shield. What is this one? Potion of healing. Okay. Let's see who needs the armor. The best Needs the armor's Indra. Does Indra use shield? I don't think so. I think he uses a hoop pack. So the next worst person is Yusuf. And Yusuf, I don't know if he uses a shield. But he could, I guess. I think that's who we'll give it to. Yusuf. Moran, trade the magic shield to Yusuf. Trade to Yusuf. Exit. Right. I think I'm going to trade these two. One to Mandrill. One to Yusuf. One to Mandrill. 